95.5 KFBS. The Teen Challenge of Mid-America and Cape Girardeau facility is celebrating 40 years. Over the decades, the organization has helped over 4,000 men recover from drug and alcohol addiction and lead a more positive life. Stephanie joins us now to tell us about the unique way the executive director is marking that big anniversary. Yeah, that's right, Lauren. Teen Challenge executive director Dr. Jack Smart is walking 80 miles. He's helping raise awareness about the program and help the men who take that difficult walk of recovery every single day. Now, Smart set out earlier today to finish that last 12 miles of his log, so he has gone 68 miles in three days. Pretty impressive. He started his final leg in Jackson. You see him here coming in to Cape at Center Junction uh, just to, about 30 minutes ago. And earlier this week, I joined him along the way on Highway 34. This isn't just a leisurely stroll in Bollinger County. It's a small stretch of an 80-mile hike, all on foot. My feet get a little sore, uh, my legs getting somewhat tired, just staying hydrated. I caught up with Teen Challenge Executive Director Dr. Jack Smart about 30 miles into his walk. He took his first steps at the Teen Challenge of Missouri Boarding Academy in Patterson on Tuesday. He'll end at the Teen Challenge of Mid-America facility in Cape Girardeau on Thursday. 80 miles door to door. 40 miles to honor the past and 40 miles to prepare for the future. To raise awareness for the organization on its 40th anniversary here in the heartland. He knows people will be talking about his walk. How many pairs of shoes do you have? I've got three with me. So far, this old pair that I've been walking in for a couple of years have held up. So I'm hoping that they, they'll hold up the rest of the way. But I'm prepared in case I have a problem. In hopes it will get them talking about his service. Even as long as we've been here, the 40 years there are still many people who don't know about Teen Challenge, and so we're trying to get the word out any way we can. Teen Challenge is a faith-based program that helps young people and men recover from drug and alcohol abuse and live healthy lives. Smart also hopes his walk can help inspire students going through the program. You just need to be slow and steady and stay on track, and you get the job done. If an old guy like me can walk 80 miles, then they can do the things they need to do to walk successfully in their relationship with Christ. It's a lesson Joel Brown has learned. I had a drug and alcohol problem. Um, I was a very selfish person. I, was, I ran my own business and I used the money basically to supply my drug habit. And uh, I felt the call of God on my life and it was, it was time for change. Brown graduates from the 10-month program on Friday. But before he does, he's joining SMART along his journey. He's a real trooper. Driving a safety van and providing water and support along the way. Brown says Smart's walk encourages him as he prepares to take his own walk into a new life. A lot of times we look at the, uh, the upper management and we think that they're far removed. And to see him take this walk and to see him step down into the ditch when traffic's coming and to see him actually take every step of the way lets me know that his heart's really into it. And again, Smart plans to finish his journey today at the Teen Challenge facility in Cape County, and we do wish him luck. He is trying to raise $1,000 for every mile he walks for a total of $80,000. A donor is matching up to $40,000 of what he raises. So if you'd like to help, you can call Teen Challenge at the number you see there on your screen. That's 573-335-6508. Lauren. I hope he makes